Hey guys, so I'm back to one of my videos. So in this video, we're gonna be uh, taking a closer look at some more Super Mario Odyssey customs that I made. Uh, and as always, if you have any more requests, leave me know in the comments. So with that said, let's take a closer look at my customs. All right, so here's my Super Mario Odyssey customs. Let's start off with the simple ones before we get into the, you know, the ones that I actually put some work in. Uh, now that I didn't put any work into these, but these were pretty simple because these, these were pretty much just repaints, except for this one right here. So for a long time, people have been requesting me to do a wing cap Mario, uh, and I finally did it. So uh, pretty much what I did is I just drill some holes on the side of the hat and on the top of the hat. Because Mario is depicted in two ways when he has when he has his wing cap, he either has them on top of his head or on the side of his uh, hat. And in case you were wondering where I got these wings, I actually got them from this um, dry bones from the Kinex line. As you can see, he's missing his wings. So this was a simple custom. It didn't even take me, you know, not even 30 minutes to make. All right, so just moving on to the repaints. These were fairly simple. Again, just pretty much just repaint them. I got a lot of requests to make the Luigi Mario, so I had no choice but to do it. Not many people requested for the Waluigi Mario, but I wanted to make one, so I did. And I also got a lot of requests to do the USA Mario. Oh, and before we talk about this one, originally I was going to make a Wario Mario, but I decided not to because not many people, well, nobody even requested it, I mean. <laughs> but, I mean, I'm not opposed to make one down the line, though. Alright, so moving on to this Mario right here. Let me start off by saying that nobody requested for me to make this one. So you're wondering, why the heck did I even make this if nobody requested it? <laughs> um, for one reason, I kind of ruined this Mario right here. So what happened is I got a new heat gun and I used heat guns to remove the hat. So I left the heat gun on Mario's face for a couple seconds more than I should have I, because I was working on another custom so, and I got careless. And then I was like, oh, oh crap, I forgot to you know turn off the heat gun. And when I went back to look at the Mario, his face was ruined from one side. His mustache got ruined. Part of his cheek got melted off. His ear got ruined. His, I mean, his ear. And a part of his, uh, the tip of the head got ruined as well. So I felt so bad uh, what happened to his Mario. And I didn't want to throw him away. So I was like, man, what the heck am I going to do? You know, I don't want to, you know, again, I don't want to throw him away. So I looked through costumes of Super Mario Odyssey to see which one I can cover his face up. <laughs> so I decided to go with the winter. I, w I was gonna do the football one, but I decided to go with the winter one because I like the design of it because it kind of reminds me of two things, Ice Climber and Naruto. <laughs> uh, so so yeah, I went with the Naruto looking one. And, I and as you can see, I totally saved him. Good thing I, uh, I thought about that, you know, trying to cover up his face. Uh, I covered his face more than I should have. But I mean, doesn't really matter. At least, at least I got to save this Mario. But yeah, let me know what you guys think about this one. Uh, did, did you like my little story on how I saved him? All right, so now let's uh, look at the wedding dress Mario. And as you already know, uh, this one was more difficult to make than all these Mario's back here. So pretty much what I did with the epoxy scope is I sculpted the hair, the earrings, the gloves, the dress. And I have to remove the buttons and the overalls just like I did to the swim trunks Mario. And I remove the part of the glove up here. That way I can cover it up with epoxy scope to make the gloves even longer. This crown right here isn't accurate to the game. But it's pretty much what I had to work with. Uh, sometimes when you do customs you just have to, you know, wing it. This actually was a Barbie necklace. So I converted it to a crown. Uh, so, I mean, I still like how it turned out. I mean, it's not bad. This was actually part of a, a charm. For your bracelet so i have to remove the part where you connect it to the bracelet this veil i bought it at hobby lobby and this custom really didn't get much request either it did get, it did get a couple of you know requests and stuff like that but uh not as much requests as other past customs but the the main reason that i did this custom is because two big youtubers challenged me to make this one but yeah when two youtube channels that are bigger than mine challenged me to make this i actually take it as a challenge and i and i uh and i went for it and i'm uh, i'm happy how it turned out yeah it's not perfect but you know i still like it all right with that said now i'm gonna cut to a few pictures
All right, so I put my Mario's with the rest of my Mario's, of course. The three Mario's that I repainted are right there. There's the Winter Mario. And there's the Wedding Dress Mario. Oh, and uh, there's a uh, Wing Cat Mario. I put it on the stand, that way it looks like it's flying. But yeah, it's getting full. I think I, think I can only fit maybe three more Mario's in here. But yeah guys, I really appreciate you watching this video. Uh, if you liked this video, please leave a like. It'll really help me a lot. And also follow me on my social media like Instagram and Facebook. But seriously guys, this has been a journey for me. Uh, remember, looking, ba looking back at my older videos, I barely had any Mario's in this cabinet. And, and look at all this. Eventually, and I am going to put more Mario's on here. So I'm pretty much going to have to remove all this stuff in here for more Mario stuff. There's my... Uh, Odyssey Bowser, in case you were wondering how it's doing. It's just chilling there for now. But anyways guys, again, thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time. Hey, it's me.